always a rainbow within reach on animal of the gang is already here. Let's see what Pig is up to. Hi, Pig. What are you painting? Can you tell what it is? A carrot! That's right! Where did you get orange paint? I mixed it myself. Want to see how? Yes, please. Okay. First, start with some yellow. <laughs> then get a little bit of red and mix it in. Look, it's turning orange. Yeah, you mixed yellow and red and made orange. I'm going to call my color sunshine orange. Nice. Mr. Goose, Mr. Goose. I made orange. Can we make that the color of the day? Hedgehog, that's a great idea. Presenting... Orange! going to show you a new way of painting. Ooh. Um, I don't see any paint brushes. That's right, Fox. We're not going to paint with paint brushes. Huh? Huh? We're going to paint with sponges. 
Ready to see what happens? Uh -huh. <laughs> okay. Do you want to start with blue paper or red paper? Mm, blue, please. And I'll take red, please. Great. Now, pick up a sponge. Dip it in the yellow paint. <laughs> and start painting. Oh, 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 look. My paper is turning orange. Because red and yellow make orange. My paper is turning green. That's right. <gasps> Look how smooth it looks. I'm tapping my sponge. <laughs> it looks rough, like, like rocks. Smooth and rough are textures. Say it after me. Textures. Textures. I'm done. Me too. Let's hang up your paintings and look at them. What's something that's the same about your paintings? We both painted with sponges. That's right. What else? We both painted with yellow. Yes. And what's something different about your paintings? Mine came out green. And pigs is orange. And my painting is rough, but foxes is smooth. That's right. Now, what do we do when we're done painting? We go play. Uh-huh. But first... <gasps> we clean up. Oh, right. That's right. Let's clean up together. Okay. okay. I'm crunching leaves. But only orange leaves. <gasps> I see one. Let's look for more. Let's look for one more. Do you see it? There it is. We did it! <laughs> Yay! See you! It's story time! Yay! Gather round, everyone. What book are we reading? We're reading this one. It's called Hippo Wants to Dance. In this story, Hippo wants to dance. Will any of the other animals dance with her? Let's find out. Let's begin. Hippo Wants to Dance. Written by Marisa Stein and Sam Beck Bessinger. Illustrated by Megan Andrews. Hippo Wants to Dance. She jumps up and down on the dusty ground. Thump, thump. You're getting dirt on me, says Snake, sleeping in the sand. Go dance somewhere else. Hippo wants to dance. She rolls into the river and splashes her arms and legs. Splish, splash. You're making me wet, says Kingfisher, hunting for her breakfast. Go dance somewhere else. Hippo wants to dance. She twirls around and around in a field, kicking her legs up high. Swoosh, swoosh. Be careful. You nearly kicked me, says Meerkat, bathing his babies. Go dance somewhere else. Hippo wants to dance. She flops into a puddle of mud and slides around on her nice big belly. Squish! Squash! Why don't you stop dancing, asks Donkey, carrying his buckets. Why can't you do something helpful instead? Hippo is sad. She is too sad to dance. She sits on a rock and cries. The tears roll down her cheeks 
and fall on the ground. Plop, plop. Grasshopper hears Hippo's tears. He starts dancing around her feet. Hop, hop. Hippo and Grasshopper start to dance. The other animals come to look. And they all dance together. The end. Thank you, Mr. Goose. Thank you for reading with me. Kids, it's time for a sing-along with Mr. Frog. Yay! Remember to say hello when you see him. Hello, everybody. It's time to sing a song together. This is a song about playing with your friends. Are you ready to sing and play? I love to sing. And I love to play. Perfect. I'll sing it first, and then we'll all sing together. Hey, hey, oh, playmate, come out and play with me. And bring your dollies three. Climb up my apple tree. Slide down my rainbow across my cellar door. And we'll be jolly friends forever more, more, more. Now everybody join in. I want to hear you too. Hey, hey, oh playmate, come out and play with me. And bring your dollies three. Climb up my apple tree. Slide down my rainbow across my cellar door. And we'll be jolly friends forever more, more, more. Thank you so much for singing with me. Let's go climb trees. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Oh, yes. Yeah. All yes. right. Let's do it. Bye, Mr. Frog. Goodbye, Goodbye Mr. Mr. Frog. Goodbye. Here's something we already did. Let's do it again. Hey, everybody. Let's practice our letters by playing the alphabet game. Yay! I want to hear you, too. Let's all play the alphabet game. When I show you a letter, say its name. Are you ready? Yeah! What's this letter? A! What's this letter? A! What's this letter? H. What's this letter? K. Now let's do it fast. H A X K X A H K H X K A H K X A. Nice work, everybody. That's how you play the alphabet. When you see a letter, you say its name! Woo! The letter A! Together and monkey around. Goodbye, friend. I'm glad we got to play together today. Goodbye. And now it's time to say goodbye. Let's sing our goodbye song. Goodbye, goodbye, it's time to say goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye, let's stop to say goodbye. Before we say hello again, we need to say goodbye. Goodbye, friend. Goodbye. Bye. Goodbye. <laughs> time to rest. Take a deep breath in. Let it out. Good. Listen. Here 
Dickory, dickory, dock. The mouse ran up the clock. The clock struck one. The mouse ran down. Hickory, dickory, dock. Tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. Hickory, dickory, dock. The mouse ran up the clock. The clock struck one. The mouse ran down. Hickory, dickory, dock. Hickory dickory dock, the mouse ran up the clock. The clock struck one, the mouse ran down. Hickory dickory dock.